Hey guys, I'm back to Buying Eyes Out of Dust. Today is second save file. Before on stream, we, we did we did a good amount of stuff. We did Greed Mode as Isaac. A lot of stuff is Kane. Some stuff is Judas. Nothing is Eve. A lot of Samson. We got four things done. And since we don't even have the, the shoal floor or any of the other stuff unlocked, yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. It's pretty good. Isaiah's or nothing. Lazarus, we did Mom's Heart. Eden, we did greed mode, since before we did greed, because I'm an idiot. And Apollyon, we did a decent amount of stuff. It, it was a good time, unless the Apollyon was on a different video, I can't actually remember. But anyway, today it's not that, it's daily time. Blue Baby. Haven't even unlocked him yet as a character. Yeah. Daily also was, it was an interesting one, let's say. Go, go see it, if you, if you want to find out what happened. It will be the... What one is it? 26th stream. I'm not very good at saying 26th. Like, I'm not very good at putting, like, a TH after an X. Six. It doesn't work. It's not. It's, it just doesn't. No. No, it just doesn't work. And now I've got a dilemma. Do I want to go for the Tinted Rock if I get a bomb? Or do I like to go for the bomb chest? Because I love stone chests. I've said it before and I'll say it again, it's one of my favourite chests in the goddamn game. Probably is my favourite. They power out with such good stuff so often, and bombs I generally underuse. It's a good start. Tried to pick it up and I just strafed around it. Well done. Oh, it gave me the decision. I think I'm going to go for the chest for the chance of getting more bombs out of it. But this could be a bad decision. And probably will be. Got the secret room and we got bombs. And a key. And a health upgrade, aka just a single soul heart. That was a good decision. And then this will give me like amazing amounts of bombs. No, it didn't. It gave me health, but I did have to spend a key for it. But basically, gave us the key and the bomb back, plus a penny and some health. So it, was, it doesn't matter which way I did that. Either way, it went well. And I'm gonna try this for a regular secret room, even though I should probably save the bomb. Okay, we can get an arcade in the next floor, possibly. Or not, we got counterfeit Benny, not bad. And we also got a luck upgrade, I didn't mention that. Luck up, pretty good. And Ron Baby currently is just gonna be a thing carrying me. I need to scratch my ear. You know you suddenly get like a sharp sort of itching or feeling of like, I need to scratch my ear now. That, that's what happened then. It wasn't sort of an annoying one, it was just sort of like, I'm gonna just mildly irritate you until you get rid of me, okay? Have fun with that. Basically, it was annoying. Can't even remember what I'm saying. Good dodge. I'm not very good at watching the shot height of monstro shots, and I did it. Torn photo. It's a pretty good item. Leave the floor. We did every room apart from the curse room, which I could have done since we didn't get hit, so we're now on 5 HP. But I wanted to leave it in case the first devil deal is, like, actually amazing, and I just didn't have the stuff for it. Anyways, key, and I'll go in here. It's not a key, though. It's not. No. Ron, baby, you killed that guy at the same time as I killed an enemy by myself. You're such a good item. Like, synergy-wise, or synergistically speaking, that's quite good. Synergistically speaking, it would have been better for me to get a damage upgrade from the first boss room, because that's good for Rotten Baby, because his flies will then do more damage, but oh well. It's not that bad, and I'm going to go straight in here, even though the item room could hold something like... D6, so I could start re-rolling stuff. Okay, I don't know how I got out of that one. Larry Jr. and Larry Sr. both just decided, you know what, we're just gonna corner you now. And I was not gonna have a good time, but six black, not six black, that's six soul hearts is pretty good. And no tears up, it's not an amazing one, but it'll do. And I don't really want that, though. We could try and get double precedent, so I will. Because I was planning on leaving that, but oh well. This might make me two-thirds conjoined, which could be good or could be bad. Since it comes with a tears downgrade, but, like, and, and slight damage downgrade. But I give you some decent stuff. And I was actually going to leave it, but then I remembered, yeah, Devil Deals are sort of the way to go in Isaac. Especially, like, on a daily, just to sort of try and make sure you're going to do well. But as Blue Baby, maybe, maybe it was a stupid idea. But we did get two black hearts in there, and we're doing decently for HP anyway. I haven't been hit yet, as far as I can remember. And there's a be super fan. 
it's pretty good. It also did give me a tears up. I was like questioning if it would or not. I guess getting the screw, like how I think tears upgrades works is because like some of them aren't as good as others, which makes sense. But how I think they work is like it gives you a flat amount and I think the screw gave me like maybe 1.5 tears up, so I didn't actually get the tears up. And because an SMB Superfan isn't a great stats upgrade, it gave me like maybe uh, 0.5 tears up, which took me then to thingy. Basically, it's just me talking about my butt, and I'm not, and I haven't really looked into things. That's an amazing pill. Paralysis is not useful. Like, I don't mean makes it so I have to take half a hit or half damage pretty smooth. That would have been good on the second secret room. Also, what was even in this room? I can't remember. It was a three. We should do that at some point. But first, let's go to the second secret room, which I feel like is going to be over here. I feel like it. Yeah, it, it looked like it to me. This could be good. And Hagalaz saves that bomb that I was going to use in that other room, so that's pretty good. Dude, I was going to say, you got to die there. You had to. You had to. Use that, get two soul hearts. This floor is going pretty well. We're not super fast, but we have a great tier right now. The gaz, I'll just use that. Answers. Awas. Now, you take Awas with you. As much as I don't want to, you just got to get your extra floors. It's highly useful. I'm tempted to go to the shop, but I'm not gonna. Not gonna. There's nothing left back there, so let's now re-roll things and pick up stuff you want. That could be good, but we have Rotten Baby, as much as it's still pretty good. And these hearts are now going to change into other things. Jeez Louise, this run. The luck that is within this run is insane. Again, we've taken a while on this floor, but still, Jesus. And now I'm going to go back to the shop, as much as I really don't want to. Ow, I just punched my desk! That was not intelligent. Yeah, I really don't want to do this, because boss rush is very valuable, but, like, the amount of stuff we just got, we got to go to the shop. And we got to re-roll, because there's a re-roll machine, if we can get a blank card. I'm tempted to go for tarot cloth, i got to admit. I was very tempted. But I didn't. Because I couldn't. You know, I wanted to keep going, but BFFs, that seems pretty good. Even though it might not even do anything with a rotten baby, now I think about it, because it might not actually affect the damage he does, since that's tied to my damage. But either way, I, I had to go BFF. Even though I still wish I could have gotten, like, a blank card. Because blank card is just good, man. Blank card is just good. And so far, I think we've done all the right plays on this run. Like, every single one. Not necessarily for boss rush, but still, does it make it so I can have two flies out at once with Rotten Baby thingy? If so, that's very good, but I doubt it. I think that just came from the chest. Seems more likely in my opinion. Shot speed's a little higher than I'd like, but it's, it, I'm comfortable with it, let's say. Higher than I'd like, but it's, it's a comfortable level. It is comfortable. Okay, we have one fly out, so I assume he can't fire out two at once, which would be great, but oh well. Okay, good speed stat, thank you. I will totally go in here. Basically traded a soul heart for a black heart and a key. Almost left a penny behind. Wouldn't have been the worst player in the world, but wouldn't have been the best either. So I'm glad I got it. I'm glad I got it. This so far seems like it could be a good daily. Now all we need is mom's knife. <laughs> We don't, but that would be cool. I want to take Callus because I'm bad, and will take damage on spikes at some point, knowing me, or creep, because that happens to me all the goddamn time. I wish it didn't. But I'm going to leave Callus. It's not a necessary thing. Now, Blue Bay's only friend isn't either, but we have BFF. So that's freaking powerful. This will carry me until... Like, boss rush, in my opinion, possibly. I hope it does. Health down. That's not that good. It doesn't actually hurt me. It just takes it away so it doesn't come under damage penalty, which is good. So, get more soul hearts and it won't have affected me at all. Yeah, that's not useful. Let's just go into the fight. See how much damage Blueberry's only friend does. 
Yep, that's like a weak Mom's Knife amount of damage. Which is pretty good, because Mom's Knife is freaking powerful. Jesus Juice, I'll take it. Makes my, like, damage stat better. As much as we're now sort of rolling on um, familiar damage, this is still pretty, pretty solid. Pretty good, you know? I feel like I'm in the zone in Isaac today. I don't know why. First run I've played, since I'm only doing single videos per day on Isaac, I apologize. If that's what you're here for, but again, I'm sorry. But, right now, I seem in the zone. Or, it's, I feel in the zone, at least. Not necessarily just seem. And we can get in here for free, because of Golden Key. So... Or not because of Golden Key, because of THE Golden Key that I picked up. Could take some mapping. Do I want some mapping? Kind of. And you know what, I didn't want to do this, but... Now I say there's two keys and a chest for a single bomb. Seems worth it, and it was. Don't know how much money I got, because I wasn't looking, but... Kind of if any pro, I did some... Well, I was gonna say some crazy shenanigans. Probably just something good. Secret room with one bomb. Golden poops. Always welcome when I have counterfeit penny. And the luck upgrade. That'd be so good if it could double that and then it gave you like two luck upgrades. I don't know if that's how it would work, but that would be freaking awesome. Well, that's max HP, so we leave now. We're gonna be just ahead of schedule. Pretty good. Almost. Almost. We're good. <laughs> We're good. Okay, into here. And down. Next floor. I am shaking right now because it's freaking cold. I was out for like two hours earlier. And yeah. Body did not like that. The body was just like, it's too cold to be out here. What are you doing? Also, have we been hit on this run yet? I feel like I haven't been hit on this run yet. I'm totally going to do this. Not a great enemy to fight when you have Bluebirds and your friend, but it's not the worst either. Good stuff. Okay, thank god that guy was not on the wall, that would have totally hit me. Oh, again, you're not the greatest enemy to be fighting. You're not the worst, but you're not the greatest. You're pretty good, just your little friends aren't. Because you're, you're just not a problem. <laughs> I'm sorry, also we have no mapping, that's a bit of a bummer. Gonna ruin my full clear plan since we're strong, so I feel like we have the ability to fall clear, but it's just taking it away from me. The money, though! That gave me an extra penny from that nickel as well. Hell yeah. God, dudes. And it's quite nice that I now just... Well, I was going to say it's quite nice that I've realised, but I just realised that Rotten Baby plus Blueberry's Only Friend are, like, a pretty good combo. I don't need the soul heart, is the thing. Or the money that much. Like, I could go for it, but I don't want to. Yeah, they're a good combo, because as I move Blue Baby's Only Friend around, it's making me shoot. And then when the fly hits from Rotten Baby, it makes another one come out. Also, I will admit on that room I should have been hit at least 12 times. Just because of bad dodges. But I wasn't. So, suck it, game. Suck it. These are the fires that I decide to shoot. Don't ask why. It's probably just a psychology thing of, okay, I made, well, I've spent an item or a consumable to get into this room, so I'm going to get everything out of it that I can. I don't know. I don't know anything about psychology. It's just me trying to say big words to make me feel smarter. Hmm, dry baby. Not the best thing in the world. I can say the same about Necronomicon, to be honest, but I'll probably take it. Because it's not the worst thing. It's sort of okay, and it's the same with the batteries. If I see a battery, I'll be like, fine, I'll use it, since I paid for the goddamn thing. Well, not paid, but it's there, so I'm going to use it. And now I know I'm going to use my space brighton when I shouldn't, because I'm stupid. Like, after every room, I see the green bar, and I'm like, okay, you should use this. Okay, protect yourself! Ah, oh, we took two hits. It's not the worst, but I didn't want to take two hits. I want to take one, like, maximum, since... We had, had quite a good streak of not being hit. It was pretty good. And also, we now have both secret rooms. Using one bomb for each instead of wasting some. Pretty solid. Use your space, Brighton, when there's two enemies on screen. Even though they both just dissolve immediately, apparently. Pretty good. We are going to skip the shop on this floor as much as I don't want to. And Shade, I'm just going to skip. And I don't think you can take nine lives. I just... No. No, and also this run is basically just becoming familiar central. So maybe it would have been a good idea to take the other dude, but... Mm, I didn't want to because he's just not good. 
That's a free thing from the shop. We should come back for it because in the meantime we can be getting money to get us more money. Or getting more money using counterfeit penny to buy more stuff with the money. I was going to say get more money to get more money. No, that's not how it works. This is not how it works. There cannot be a secret room adjacent to this room. Since if we look up here, there's, there's the void over there. Well, there's a rock, but still, it, it can't be where that rock is. This is bad. I've made a horrible mistake here. Yep, shot it at the wrong time. This is when I start to take bad damage. I'll take it. It's not a bad item. It's not the best, but it's not horrible. So I'm taking it. Could become an amazing synergy if we get something like Death Touch, which we can totally afford from a Devil Deal right now. We can also get it from other pools, but Devil Deal is the most likely place. Thank you, Bomb, for actually getting the secret room. I didn't place it very well. The bomb, not the secret room. Grabbing all the monies. Okay, here's the shop. And here's a chance to get something amazing. Again. Because reroll machines. Okay, start using money. No. Yeah, should have gone to back for the other thing. I'll do that after this one, if it gives me something good. Which it really didn't, so that's a waste of the trinket. Since I want to stick with counterfeit pennies, it'll give me more money over time. Use it, gave you a battery charge. Might as well. And this space item, as far as I remember at least, does decent damage on bosses. Like, not insane amounts of damage, but it's not horrible. It's not horrible. I'm excited. That's pretty horrible. Pretty damn horrible. This looks like a second secret room to me. Don't have any bombs. Fair enough. Paralysis. Well, I don't want that, is the thing. It's just not good, you know? Nailed it. Okay, I thought Blueberry's only friend was going to destroy it then. And I got nervous, because that would have been a stupid move. The lightning bolts, therefore, therefore, they just do, so worry about that. It's good. It's real good. Secret Room's been great on this run so far. Like, look at that. We played, we used one bomb to get in here, and look what we got out of it. A damage upgrade, a load of bombs back, a bit of money, some keys, I think. It's good stuff. Freaking good stuff. I'm gonna leave the rest of this floor though. Bloat. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna leave the rest of this floor so I can hopefully just do the next floor full clear if I want. I don't know. Health up. Take that after the deal with the devil, which we did actually get, surprisingly. Take another damage up. And I'm tempted to take multi dimensional baby. You know? Speed up pretty good. I'm just gonna leave though. I'm just gonna leave. We've taken probably like four or five hits on the run so far. Admittedly, two of them want the same room, which is not great. But the room I got hit on also is not great, in my opinion. I, I'm just not good at it. I'm not good. Sadly, now the light show whenever I fire because of Tech Zero is kind of hurting my brain. Not hurting, just making me think, okay, I should be shooting more, which I possibly should. Not the worst run in the world to do it on. Still shaking, because it's freaking gold! That was bad. Didn't even see that guy there. Also bad. Getting hit twice on rooms, but also it gave me a soul heart on the room that I got hit on, which is very nice. Thank you. Wish I had my space button charged for that room. Would have been lovely. And I possibly should have shot them. Now I think about it, it's just because I'm used to using Blue Baby's only friend at this point. And again, I just remembered, like, we're playing as Blue Baby, and we got Blue Baby's only friend. So beautiful. It's just, it was meant to be. It was meant to be. I don't want you, though. You were not meant to be. You were not. I will take the quarter, because I can. Ah, sack of sacks. Dropped a sack that had the tower. Can it give me anything good? Since it can, oh, I was going to say it can break those rocks to give you wonderful things, but didn't do it. Didn't do it. Okay, glad that I did come to this floor when I did, since this is the wrong direction. Wish I could have bombed both of those things at the same time, but at least we got a bomb back. Pretty good. <sighs> Almost got hit by that. Would now have been the first time that I've walked into that damage, but I didn't do it that time, so suck it. I'm a genius. I'm a freaking genius. Almost got hit by that thing. Absolute genius. Joker. 
use it. Krampus. Not the worst. I will take your space button, like, no doubt. So, I was gonna say, feel free to give it to me. You didn't. Maybe I was doing reverse psychology. Maybe I wanted that. Hmm? You ever think of that game? You ever think of that? Hmm? 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 You thinking? You thinking about it now? You better be thinking about it. You better. <laughs> what am I talking about? Stop spawning enemies. Don't get hit immediately. It's not nice. We've already been to the shop. Do not want. Almost used AOR since I wanted to do that. Could use number two for this, but I don't like number two. We don't have a very good relationship, okay? And we got to this floor clearly earlier than we needed to. We have so much time. So much time. Blue Baby's only friend plus the static tears plus Rotten Baby is good. Now I think about it, the damage upgrades I was taking aren't the worst thing because we have Rotten Baby as well. I hadn't even remembered Rotten Baby. I'm so sorry, Rotten Baby. I didn't mean to, like, accidentally forget you existed. I honestly didn't. Hopefully that's not, like, a two of spades. Well, wish I came here first. Luck up, that's good. That's really good. It's another Joker card. We don't need that. That is not required. That is not anything that we would need right now. You know, let's start using some tears. Because our tears are relatively strong. I say relatively. They just are strong. That's pretty good. And boss trap depends what's in it, man. Mmm. I don't want it. Tinted rock. Give me small rock, please. Because I can't take the health. <laughs> I just can't. And I'm not going to do boss trap. I can't. I just can't. Okay, I don't want your troll bomb, thanks. And now we leave. And we're back to, like, a good amount of money. So it wasn't the worst thing for us to have bought the item that we did. Can't even remember what it was. And you know what? I'm going to spend a single bomb here, since I have infinite keys. For the remainder of the floor. One's a charged key. That's very nice. I was going to say, so we can get that for free, but nope, that requires bombs as well. Fair enough, let's leave. But I'll quickly look for a secret room first. Quickly. Very briefly. Very quick. Didn't get it, okay. Okie dokes. We can leave. We can leave. You know what? Just use your tears, man. And, like, occasionally, Blue Baby's only friend will do some damage. Like it was doing there. Okay. And remember, you don't have to worry about Deal the Devil. It was just Krampus. You don't even have to enter. You're not going to be slow anyway if you enter, but still. It does not matter. Take the Polaroid. It's the better one. Rubber Cement. That seems like it would be amazing. Since it allows the tears to bounce around longer. Which means the laser beams will be beautiful. Yeah. Glad I took Tech Zero. Very glad. And also, I think occasionally my familiar's tears will do the same thing and have laser beams that connect to my tears. I'm not sure though. I might be incorrect. Okay, this is a bad couple of bosses to have at the same time, but we, we dealt with it. Now I think Dueling Run is just not get hit. It's very obvious. That looks like it's a Joker card, because we've had a lot of those on this floor, and I think Sack of Sacks is guaranteed to pay out some of the same things. So that's probably just a 17th Joker card. And we don't have to worry about Boss Rush, this just goes to Mum's foot, so Boss Rush cannot even spawn. So don't worry about it. Ah, that's something I forget. With Rubber Cement, Tears no longer knock things back. Like, enemies, bombs, you cannot knock them back, so... Be a bit cautious when it comes to knocking things back, because sometimes it's just not going to work and you're going to get hit. Range, not as good as I'd like with Rubber Cement, gotta admit, but we haven't had any range upgrades that I can think of that I intentionally left behind. Fair enough, we can just go ham on killing these bosses like that. That was pretty smooth. That was pretty smooth. I don't think I've been hit so far on Boss Rush. I'm not going to say it for certain, though, because I'm not sure. I hope I haven't. Because that would make this one of the lowest damage dailies that I've ever had. That wasn't, like, you know, a Lost Daily or a Keeper Daily. Even though Lost Dailies, you take even less than the Keeper, since the Keeper doesn't have the strength. Didn't even see the little mini horn. Yet, I didn't get hit by it, because I am amazing. I'm not. I just got relatively lucky. Mask of Infamy. You're not going to be so bad, since the laser beam is going to destroy you. 
God, I'm happy that I took um, Tech Zero, man. Something I leave quite often. Well, not quite often. It's just on the daily. I was like, do we need it? Are we gonna like ever get any use out of it? And I thought it'd be a gamble, and it was a gamble that paid off. Since again, rubber cement is basically a kind of piercing shot. Like it's not a piercing shot, but it does or it can keep going after it hits an enemy. Thank you for the freeze there, dude. And by freeze, I mean like the pause from Dry Baby. The pause helped me out. Is that... Ah, I thought you were the cage. I thought you were the cage. You're mega fine. Cage, much worse on Boss Rush, since he has the spikes of doom that I hate with a freaking passion. I hate it so much. That might hit me. Okay. He didn't pop up next to me. Good. Good. And we can take the sun card with us. Since we're going to be using AWARS here. What hit me? Nothing. I thought I heard the sound of you getting hit. My bad. Who is it? Okay, it's you guys. You're not that bad. Ah, it's Gertie. I knew I saw shots coming from the double screen. Didn't know who it was. Oh, I didn't see you uh, till the last second doing your attack. My bad. My bad. That would have been a great time to have seen. John Cena. Do 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 do. I'm not funny or original. I apologize. Okay. Is it over? The D8. That seems pretty good. Since we can g use this a bunch of times to get something good. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, though. Yeah. We did get the passage down. That's something I should have thought about. Do you want to take that or the sun? I'm going to take this since I'm going to full clear anyway, as much as it's kind of nice to have it. And this will heal me for the next floor, which is very nice. Then we can have a bunch of cards. Well, that heals me now. One temperance. Two temperance. Um, three temperance. Blows them up. You'll probably get less than what you spent. Even, well, you got a lot of money, but still. Probably less than you spent. Take the Joker, since you only got one, which is surprising. Down to the next floor. Now we can just hope for a self-sacrifice room. That'll be a big play. That would be a big play. And we have a decent amount of speed. What's my range like? My range doesn't seem that good. Which isn't great, but too freaking fire rate, though. There's freaking... Wow, health. Yeah, we have a two fire rate. We lost a little bit of damage. It would be nice if we could have had it a bit more even. That's nice as well. Like a bit more even with like lower speed, higher range, but I'm fine. There's more speed. Apparently, it must have taken something away from my speed modifier since it gave me one point. Oh wait, no, I was gonna say it gave me one point one four or zero point one four, but that's all it could have given me anyway. Since I'm at the speed cap. My bad. Even more HP. And money that I can't even take, so I'm not even going to bomb it, since that would just be wasting a bomb. Okay, please, game, give me a thing that I am desiring. Which basically means, give me self-sacrifice room. Now, addicted. Well, at least it didn't get hit on that room, because that would have done double damage, which would have been pretty bad. Pretty bad. Not the worst, but pretty bad. There was a tinted rock in the room before this, so I will quickly go back and blow that up. I think I can reach it. Just a boot. Yeah, and we got two bombs back. I was just like, well, we're at max HP, so we don't need it, but if we get a self-sacrifice room, we might as well go for it. But instead, I, I got my bombs back, so even if we can't use it, it was worth it. Good stuff. Now that, I don't see a universe where it could be useful, unless I have invincibility, since it's a daily, so I'm not going to be like, well, it's not going to be too bad, since if we get hit, it's not a problem. It's a mild problem since it takes away some of my points, which I've got a decent amount of on this run. Better than decent. Way better than decent. Okay, I was going to blow that one up. Let's not. Let's not. And I'm going to quickly check if this is a secret room. It looks like it. Nailed it. First bomb. I want to bring temperance in here to blow it up, but I, I couldn't be bothered, you know? Really? Just, I just couldn't be bothered. 
Okay, I should fight the boss before doing this, and I think it'll end the run on this floor if I don't get a self-sacrifice room. Well, hopefully it doesn't, since we didn't get one. Which will be a bummer. A big old bummer. I don't even think I've used my space per item on this floor. Just because the run's so good. That it doesn't require it. Like, the beams plus the bouncy tears is what's making this run. Thank you, Blue Baby's Only Friend, for saving me early on. But now you're not required. My eyes don't even move. They're just... They're just flat. My, his eyelids are apparently going so quickly that you can't even see it moving. That's that's some fast blinking you got there, Isaac. Some pretty fast blinking. But now is the moment of truth. Or we can try and get the shovel from using the joke card. That's another option. Hopefully I don't have to go down that avenue. I really don't want to. Like, I'll still use the joke card. I don't really care since we don't need it. Okay, we'll end, so please. No. 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 No, though. No. No, 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 no. I want to go further. Maybe I should have had a teleport card to get out of the last floor. To get to the self-sacrifice room that was guaranteed to be there. Balls. I could go to the curse room, but I don't want to. I want to keep my damage penalty as low as possible, and the chance of that working out is super low. And we got both the secret rooms, so we out. We out. What do we get? 147th. Yep. The one time I get under a thousand damage penalty, which is like once in a blue moon. Didn't get the best rank, because I didn't get the self-sacrifice. Must have just been on the last floor then. And I was one point ahead of Nightmare. Sorry Nightmare, better luck next time. <laughs> I'm joking. I'm joking. But still, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you do well out there you play yourself. And I'll see you guys next time. See ya!